Have you been disappointed by a family member leaving you feeling rejected and rethinking the whole relationship and thinking it's going down the tubes? Well, in this video, part six of 13 Reasons Why You're Estranged, we're unpacking how unfulfilled expectations create an atmosphere for estrangement. You'll learn five reasons why unmet expectations can lead to estrangements. Hi, I'm Marie Morin. I'm a therapist and a wellness coach. Let's get started. Let's explore why unmet expectations can become a significant factor in family estrangement. Things like, I always expected my parents to support my decisions, but they didn't seem to understand me. I thought my siblings would always have my back, but they let me down when I needed them the most. I hear this all the time in my practice. I hear things especially revolving around disparate values. And we talked about that in the last video with people saying, you know, I came out and told people what my sexual orientation was and the response from my parents was just heartbreaking they they just shut me out and left me you know alone didn't want anything to do with me anymore and these stories are just heartbreaking and then there's individuals who just get really in a funk and want their family to be in the mire with them and help them and help them get out and the family is just sometimes nowhere to be found or they just are in a sea of their own stuff and not doing things to help the um the sibling so you know i hear about this heartbreak and these individuals who are feeling so much like you know my family doesn't understand me or they've got it all wrong or I'm just so disappointed because I was hoping for support and there wasn't any. What the research is saying is that often um, adult children are talking about favoritism and comparisons and these are their perceptions and this is how they're feeling. And they are looking for this level of equality that just isn't there. Oh, that sibling was favorite and they got everything and I got nothing. And so a lot of that goes on. And what I'm hearing is, is that these expectations of how family members should behave or treat each other, when they're not met, there's these feelings of disappointment, frustration, resentment, and very often feeling rejected. One key aspect of unmet expectations is the idea that we all need to regulate our feelings, right? We need to regulate our emotions because when we are dysregulated, when we're really upset, we're no longer working from the prefrontal cortex where we're thinking, right? We're, it's all coming out of the amygdala. It's all coming out of the emotional center. And then a lot of things can be said and done that we later on can regret. One key aspect of dealing with feeling like your expectation is unmet is learning how to handle your emotions and just getting yourself calm. Setting clear boundaries can also protect ourselves from further hurt. And another thing is, is to get support. You know, have someone in your corner, someone who can give you guidance and perspective. And research indicates that a quarter of Americans are estranged from their family members. And this number is very likely on the low side because we know that there's a lot of stigma and people aren't talking about how often they're estranged. So here's five ways these unmet expectations can lead to estrangement. And the first one is unmet expectations can erode trust within a family. So when we have certain expectations about how our family members should behave or interact with us and they're, they aren't met and we could feel betrayed or disappointed, over time, these repeated disappointments can cause us to lose trust in the family members and distance ourselves from them. Number two, unmet expectations can create this cycle of conflict within families. When one person's expectations kind of clashes with another, you can have 
heated arguments and conflicts escalate over time. It can be very toxic, communication can break down, and family members can be agitated, become distant. And when families find themselves in this type of mess, it's a good idea to get help from a therapist, or you can reach out to me to have a strategy session. Follow the link in the description box and bio to do so. And number three, is unmet expectations can lead to feelings of resentment. When we repeatedly experience this type of disappointment or frustration due to the unmet expectations, it can breed resentment over the family members. These negative feelings can fester over time, poisoning our relationships and really making it difficult to reconnect. And number four is unmet expectations can ultimately result in estrangement because family members can sense the gap of the expectation. It becomes too wide to bridge and it could lead us to withdraw from family connections. Estrangement may seem like the only way to protect ourselves from further disappointment or pain, though it comes at a great emotional cost. We know through research that when individuals estrange, there is an emotional cost. Number five is family secrets can lead to this type of unmet expectation. We all have an expectation that people are going to be real with us and honest with us. And when that trust of honesty is broken, it can really destroy the bonds within a family. It leads to the unmet expectation of trust and this breakdown creates tension in the relationship and these discrepancies in openness and trust can strain the relationship and potentially lead to estrangement. Family secrets and how that's a contributing factor we're going to discuss that in video eight, so stay tuned. So to address unmet expectations and prevent estrangement, it's essential to communicate openly and honestly. Say what you mean, mean what you say. Say it in a way that you can communicate well to your family members. There's a way to do it. We can do this. By learning how to express our needs, and feelings calmly, assertively, can we can work towards understanding and compromise. Forgiveness can also play a crucial role in healing strained relationships. Creating a positive environment for ourselves can help us cope with the challenge of family dynamics and estrangement. Ultimately, by fostering empathy, understanding, and forgiveness, we can navigate the complexities of family relationships more effectively. Remember, healing is possible even in the face of unmet expectations and family estrangement. And understanding how unmet expectations can lead to estrangement is just the beginning of the journey. If you haven't caught the rest of the series, we've talked about things like divorce, when one parent turns kids against the other, parental alienation, poor communication patterns, disparate values, enmeshment, and survival and personal growth. So don't forget to subscribe so you can get the next in the series for more insightful content and hit the like and leave me a comment. Together, let's go on this journey towards healing and reconciliation when it's possible.